sing hallelujah, but what is that to you right now? But let's talk in a way that can give us some faith to go around. We're all tight as we can when it's better again. And that'll sustain me for now. Alright, welcome to Paranormal no After Dark. I want to thank everybody. Sorry being so busy. I've got a new deck coming out. Uh, setting up the store, trying to get it on the <laughs> up and running so I can make some of the money that I've invested. Which is around about $6,000 right at the, as we speak. But that's beside the point. Uh, I want to thank all the subscribers. I want to thank everybody. Uh, I haven't got to touch much on the Idaho 4. Uh, Kaylee... Zana, Madison, and Ethan. So, we're going to try to figure out, like, things just don't add up to me. Like, so there was two people that lived, four that died. Two people that was downstairs lived. The, the people upstairs that died. I, I think that's how it is. I'm not really for sure. I don't think I've watched just what the news has put out. Um, what, I mean, if, if you're going to walk into someone's house, why wouldn't you kill them all? Um... That's really weird, and by what the news is saying is that some of them uh, died more uh, terribly than the others. Some of them were, you know, just not good. Uh, so it, it seems like it was very deliberate on the ones that he did horrifying things to. It's like he had motive for, for them. So uh, certainly Kaylee... And, uh, you know, uh, Madison and, and all of them. So, let's jump into this and see what happens. Kaylee, Madison, Zanna, and Ethan, can you just come in this room for me, please? <coughs> I need you to just come through as clear as you can, please, for me. Uh, I, I, I come in love, light, and peace to you. Can you feel this love, light, in this room? Zanna, Madison, and Kaylee, and Ethan, help me kind of close some of this up. Like, what happened the night of uh, of of the murder? <laughs> Who done this to to y'all? Can can you give me any more clues? Like the last session I done, you told me Thomas, a guy named Thomas. Is that still true? Can you give me a yes or no, maybe on that, please? Yes. And if it was a guy named Thomas, where did you meet him? How was you associated with this guy? <coughs> Did it, maybe I ordered pizza, maybe? Zanna, Madison, Ethan, and, and Kaylee, I, I'm so sorry that this happened to y'all. Uh, I truly apologize. I know that you're up there with God, but right now we need answers. Uh, the police is not handing out much. Things ain't adding up. Why was just the four of y'all targeted, targeted in that house? Did you just know that Jones is killer? Or was this just something that happened ran, random? Boy. Were there any motive of why he done this to you? Why he done this to all four of y'all? To come 
come through as clear as you can for me, please. <laughs> Kaylee, Madison, Zanna, and Ethan. Ethan, I'm not. If you can't come through, was this maybe an inside job? <laughs> Was you just having a good time that night that this murder took place? I know there were six of y'all all together. <laughs> and did you just know the person that done this? Like I said, did you just know him, know him? Was he invited? Was it uh, a party going wrong? Like, if there wasn't even any partying, I'm not really for sure. <laughs> Why does the police not want your family to take out... Um, like, the family wants to put re re reward money out for y'all's case. Why does the police not want that to happen? Or flyers or anything like that. Was this someone maybe from y'all's school? Ethan, are you here with us too? Ethan, can you come in this room with me? What happened hours before this happened? Just trying to wrap my head around all of this. Like, why the confusion? Why, you know... Kelly Madison, Ethan, Zana, how did how did this person get in the house? How did he leave the house? How did the person that done this to you leave the house? Hmm. There's so many questions that there's just not enough time to cover it in one in one you know session. Um why was the murder so much more brutal on two of y'all than the other two? Well, did he know you personally or did this person know you personally the ones that got cut up the worst out of y'all <laughs> Kaylee, Zena, Madison, Ethan, are there anything that you want to say to your family at this time for me? So 
I come in love, life, peace to you. This is your time to speak, if that's okay. I know that your your families are very mourning. Uh, they miss you. The people at your school is mourning. I said, this is your time to speak if you want to say anything to them. Do you love them and do you miss them? I like to What was the cause of y'all's death? Can you please give me that clue? Are there anything else that you can tell me, like the number one key that would solve this case? What would lead the police to solve this case completely? To who done this to you? Was it someone that you were talking to on social media? Can you give me a yes or no on that, please? Was this someone that you were talking to on social media? Well, I want to thank you so much for coming through for me, okay? God bless you and all. God bless y'all. All right, guys. I'm going to start trying to get back to where I'm posting every other day at least. It's just, I... <laughs> I, I'm so busy, I'm so tired, it's like every hour is consumed with something, and I want to make time for what I love the most, and this is it right here, um, as you just can tell, um, it's also doing medium readings and making someone's day, and you know, it's all about y'all, it's all about the spirits, it's all about keeping it real, um, you know, and, and my biggest thing that I try to do is is move the paranormal forward, move the community make the communication forward. It it's truly all about that. Please excuse my bell palsy. It's sometimes hard to speak certain words that you know. But I see so many creators that get stuck and they they don't move forward. Like I see them still using the same app that they was using five years ago, to where I'm trying to push the paranormal literally to its limits. The, the communication to its limits and anything that I can do to do that I'm going to do so you know it's it's that's where my passion is is how can we move this forward how can we get the you know the best uh, communication that we can so I want to thank y'all God bless y'all till next time I'll see you in Zen